Good morning, everybody. I don't know about you, but it is so hard to believe that we are already into July. Seems like June just flew by, and it's already been a few weeks since I've given you a tour of what's been growing on in my Zone 6B Cleveland, Ohio Balcony Garden. But before I give you an update, I just wanted to thank all of you who are watching, commenting, liking, and sharing, and subscribing to my channel. I can't tell you all how much I really appreciate all of your support and encouragement. It really, really means a lot to me, so thank you. Now, let's take a look and see what's been growing on, the good, the bad, and the ugly, in my Zone 6B balcony garden. so now we're out on the balcony I found two sage plants at the big W that just said rescue me so I had to bring them home tomatoes are happening this is my pear tomato it's getting flowers all on it new flowers coming here so we'll be eating good soon this is one of the smaller Tommy toes and it's getting flowers and tomatoes. We're just waiting. Potatoes are still here, waiting on them to die back before it's time to harvest. The spearmint is back here hiding in the corner. It needed a little more sun. Waiting on the green peppers. They're just slowly taking their time. This is another Tommy Toe. Little tomatoes here and here. This is the bigger Tommy Toe. Getting loaded with flowers and tomatoes. The bush beans are going wild. Full of little beans all in there. Nothing too much with these peppers here. They're growing, but not much anything else. The chard and the kale are doing great in this one. Not too much growth on this current tomato. But it's probably just getting shaded out by the Tommy Toe. My oregano. And my nemesis that I am just going to end up pulling out. Planting some bunching onions in it for now and starting over on the kale. Because aphids have just taken it over. Aphids everywhere. The strawberries. This is the new plant that came off of the runners. And this is a new one off of the runner. The herbs are doing well. Nasturtiums have bloomed. Calendula has bloomed. Just all that pretty color going on over there. My tuli basil is doing great. Might drop some more marigold seeds. The loofah is just slowly growing. If you got any suggestions, let me know. So I can put it in a bigger pot and hopefully get some loofah. Stevia is starting to bush out a little bit. Lemon balm has gone crazy. This is the other pepper plant. It's just hanging on. We lost its counterpart due to the aphids. 
aphids are just evil and just tearing up everything. And not only did this kale get hit with aphids heavily, but I ended up actually getting leaf miners in it too. So if anybody got any suggestions, leave them in the comments for me on what to do when I start over. And that's about it. New calendula are coming up on this one that'll bloom soon. But right now we are engulfed in tomato plants and I am not complaining. Tomatoes and beans. But that is fine by me. And all the sun out here. Got to pot up the sage. Because I will always rescue a plant if I can find room for it. And that's about it. Thanks for watching. And if you got any tips or suggestions, leave them for me in the comments. And I will see you on the next video.